Welcome to For the Mind's Eye. I am the Creepy Craft Goddess and today we are going to make this coffin shaped pillow. I'll show you how I made the, uh, the custom pattern for this and how it's done. If you've never been to my channel before, I make all kinds of uh, creepy crafts and I like anything spooky. Um, my necklace you see here, the little skull, that'll be um, that's an upcoming video, so stay tuned for that. Um, you definitely want to hit subscribe so that you don't miss it. The materials that you're going to need to make this coffin pillow are um, a black fabric and a white fabric. Um, I do not recommend a stretchy material because you're gonna your line your corners aren't going to stay as. Uh, as clean they're going to tend to want to round out and um, you really don't want that when you're making a coffin shape so um, not stretchy material you're going to need black um, probably about half a yard um, if you're doing this size but size um, the amount that you need may vary depending on what size you make your pillow um, so black um, white you won't need very much the white is just this um, white bias tape that's what I got this line that's why it's so uniform <laughs> is because that is bias tape um, you're also going to need white and black thread you can choose to sew this by hand or you can sew it on machine um, I prefer machine you will also need um, the filler of your choice whether that be polyfill or whatever you choose um, you will also need to make the pattern for the the pillow. You will need um, you will need newspaper. This shape for the cross, I actually um, printed something out. I tr I drew it like three or four, maybe five different ways, and then um, once I finally got it the way that I wanted it, um, I cut it out of newspaper and made a pattern out of it that way. So um, I'll show you how you make the pattern. So all of your materials, black fabric, white fabric, not stretchy. You will need bias tape. You will need newspaper for the pattern. You will need black thread and white thread. And you will also need polyfill um, or whatever fiber fill you choose, whatever fill you choose to use um, for your pillow. So, uh, let's get
that's how we make the coffin pillow. If you liked what you saw and you want to see more, hit the little subscribe button so you'll get notifications when I um, put new videos out. Also, um, everything that you see on my channel is available at my Etsy store and that will be listed below. And so, hope you enjoyed making the coffin pillow. If you have any questions, leave them in the in the comment section and I'll try to get to those. Also check out my other videos, subscribe to the channel, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Until then, stay creepy and crafty.